hello friends welcome to logic component channel and in this section we will learn about process management then first we see process what is process a process is basically a program in a execution is called as process the execution of a process must progress in a sequential fashion to put it in a simple terms we write our computer programs in a text file and when we execute this program it becomes a process which perform all the task mentioned in that programs then we see the process management process management is the one of the service of operating system or one of the function of operating system the process management module take care of creation and deletion of processes scheduling of system resources to different processes requesting them and providing mechanism for synchronization and communication among different processes then we see the process state in multi programming operating system when a process execute it passes through different states these states may differ in different operating system and the names of these states are also not standardized processes can be any of the following states there are different types of states the first is new the new is a state and the process is in the stage of being created or when process is created is in the new state second ready the process has all the resources available that it needs to run but the cpu is not currently working on this process instructions is called as ready state or that process is in a ready state then next running once the process has been assigned to a processor by the operating system scheduler the process state it set to running and the processor execute its instruction next waiting the process cannot run at the moment because it is waiting for some resource to become available or for some event to occur that state is called waiting then next terminated once the process finishes its execution or it is terminated by the operating system it is moved to the terminated state where it waits to be removed from main memory these are the different types of state we see in the diagram this is a new state when process process is admitted in the computer system that is new state then new state is become ready come in a ready state and then ready state and when resources is available then process is go to the running state is go to the running state the ready state has the os scheduler which dispatch the process to the running state and when process is in running state then if there is a any problem or interrupt occur then is again become the ready state and ready and running state running state process is wait for input output devices or any event so running state is go into the waiting state for wait the input output devices and when input output devices is available or event is occur then waiting state process is again become the ready state and when processor 
or CPU is available then process is go to the running and process is in a running state or task is completed or execution is complete, completed then process is exit that is terminated and it is exit from the main memory this is a different process state thank you and subscribe our channel logic computer institute for more videos